City of Garland factoid number 18. What happens to all the city equipment and vehicles when they're not in use? Hmm, that's a good question. Tell us, Terry. Once a year, the city takes all of its surplus equipment. We gather it all year long as we replace vehicles, and then we turn around and we have a once a year auction. So you have a variety of different pieces of equipment here, from our environmental waste department to our electric department. Several of our police cars are here. And uh, we have a pretty good turnout, as you see, every year at this. Uh, and we look for it to go back to our equipment replacement fund that we use to buy our new vehicles and equipment. We replace about 150 to 170 vehicles per year out of our 1,800 vehicle and equipment fleet. And we look for this to hopefully deposit a uh, pretty good number to help offset that buy every year. And uh, we have a lot of folks that follow us year to year here and that purchase our equipment. Uh, one of the things we do, and we make sure that our buyers are aware of what they're buying. We disclose everything with the vehicle in this condition or if there's any issues. And so, therefore, by doing that, we get a lot of repeat folks. They know what they're getting when they go home and there's no surprises. And uh, so we've got a good reputation in that area. And that helps us at our auction every year. Wow, she can talk fast. This was the City of Garland factoid number 18. Until our next fact, keep them straight.